Welcome back, Rock Raiders. I'm your host, R.R. Slugger, and today we're trying something new, creating our own combiner models from Rock Raider sets. What exactly is a combiner model? Well, imagine you have two different retail sets, break them down into pieces, and then use those parts to build something new from your own imagination. That's basically it. The LEGO group used to have quite the history of including these in various LEGO magazines or web pages. These days, they're quite the rarity, but I'd say it's high time we brought some more into the world. After working on the Kabaya Rock Raiders retrospective episode, I was inspired to create a combiner model of my own using two of the retail sets. I decided to start small by merging 4910 and 4920, the Hover Scout and Rapid Rider. The result? A mid-sized flyer I like to call the Sector Scout. Notably lacking any drilling equipment, I imagine the Sector Scout to be a vehicle used for preliminary cartography of a new cavern. The craft has two stations aboard it, one for piloting the vehicle and the other for cataloging geological data using the scanners on the ventral side. I'd also like to think that the Rock Raiders would have a general map handy, downloaded from the LMS Explorer's planetary survey. You wouldn't want to get lost in an undiscovered cavern. The Sector Scout features running lights on both ends of the craft. This is used for lighting up dark caverns, as well as remaining visible to any large drilling vehicles that may be following below. The two jet engines allow the Sector Scout to remain in flight for long periods of time, sometimes facilitating survey missions where the vessel only sets down once it returns to HQ. There is some limited storage capacity in the rear cargo hold, but typically I doubt the crew would do much hauling with this craft, unless the discovery was too tempting to pass up. In addition to the Sector Scout, I used some of the leftover pieces to create a small side build. I imagine this to be a teleport beacon or booster of some sort, a device that allows the teleporter aboard the LMS Explorer to target deeper caves than it normally could. I think this could be used to start mining operations in new quadrants or lock onto stranded miners. Lastly, here are the remaining pieces that I didn't end up using. Overall, I'm really happy with the results of this experiment. Hopefully you've enjoyed listening to Slugger's own little addition to Rock Raiders fanfiction. Which two sets should we combine next? Well, that's where you come in. I would love to hear your suggestions for the next episode in the comments below. Please use either the set names or set numbers. You could also add some stipulations or other ideas too. For example, you could say combine the Rapid Rider and Tunnel Transport, but the result cannot be a flying vehicle, stuff like that. Keep in mind that Slugger is somewhat of an internet regent and likely won't be turning these suggestions into a popularity contest. He'll likely go with the idea that intrigues him the most, so before you race to the comments to suggest combining the two biggest sets, try to think of something that would make that project unique first. In addition to everything here, I'm also considering turning the design and construction process of these models into opportunities to live stream. The first two we had were so much fun, I'd like to continue to host more. Creating what became the Scrap Smelter on air last time really turned me on to the idea of building more mocks on live stream, and combiner models present the perfect way to avoid the sound of digging through Lego bins for hours on end. <laughs> Once again, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. If you've constructed any combiners you'd like to share, feel free to send them to my email. In terms of combiner suggestions, let's keep it limited to within the 8 retail sets before we open the floodgates some more. I'd like to have a few exclusively Rock Raiders builds under my belt before we start mixing in other themes. Thanks for watching, everyone. I've been your host, RR Slugger, and I hope to see you next time for some more high adventure deep underground.